That's a mounter. What's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're out here at a local lake. Try, coming to try to track down some fish. It's pretty windy so it'll be an interesting day. Never fished here before. I've been told by a couple locals already that this bat, this is a very good bass spot as it is filled with them. Now there's multiple uh, four to seven pounders coming out of here. And uh, yeah, so we're gonna give it a shot, see what we get, and enjoy the video. So to start this fishing, we're going to start here with this, uh, I believe it's called Watermelon Yamamoto Worm, weedless hook. Usually it does pretty good in the toolies because it doesn't snag them. But here on the weed line, I might pull out the crank. We'll see what we get. Let's give it a first cast. Beautiful lake. Seen tons of eagles, tons of little eagles. If they fly over, I'll get you guys a shot of them. Tons of fish in here. I watch them just come down and snatch them right out here. Just moving locations here. The wind is blowing me around kind of good. See if I can get away from the wind a little bit.
So far, it's not too hot. Found this nice little pocket out of the wind, which is nice. And I think I may have saw a bass spawning right on the shoreline there. So I might toss some uh, top water and see if I can get one to get excited. The Yamamoto ain't working. I haven't even had a bite yet, but we'll see. Does anyone know what kind of fish those are? I mean, he almost has ran into the boat. I didn't get video of that. I never, it's hard to recognize them. I don't know what they are. I'm guessing some kind of carp. They're just golden, so. Hmm. I'm gonna have to try to throw on something and try to catch one of them. Decent sized fish. I am striking out so far. I don't know. They have like lockjaw, so. Move locations quite a bit. I'm gonna go up in this little area up above and, uh, See if I can get a fish or two. I mean, hoping for something. and a largey on a first fish of the new kayak and then and this lake a lake nice decent little large mouth how exciting i was not expecting that i had the gopro turned off and trying to save a i only have a couple minutes left for footage and striked it let's go nice fish Finally got onto one. Took a couple hours. I was just looking at some of these fish that were just jumping, casted there, and he struck it. A decent little largey. Fought a little bit. I had the GoPro turned off, and I was like, holy crap, turn it on, turn it on. Yep. Nice little fish. Well, see you later, dude. Largey. Another really nice largey. <laughs> Sorry about the GoPro footage again. I'm just trying to save the time. I don't know why if I should just get it over with. Nice fish here. A little bit bigger than the last one. Let's hope they keep getting bigger. It's kind of near the same spot. Fun. See you later, dude. <laughs> Let's see if we can't get some more.
Wish I had my GoPro going for this one. Oh, he is monster. Talk about a behemoth of a bass. Some nice fishermen just came over and weighed him and measured him 20 inches and six pounds. This guy is massive. This is awesome. First time ever here at Aloka or Aleka or something, however you see this lake. And I can tell you one thing, it has produced. Holy crap, it's heavy to hold up. Let this guy go so someone else can have the fun in catching him. What a blast. Yep. Well, I think it's time, my time to say goodbye. FaceTime the parents and showed them. Time to let him go. He is monster. Awesome bass. Definitely one of my top biggest basses I've ever caught in my life. If not the biggest, he's big. I can't really recall, but I'm gonna let him go and uh, let someone else enjoy the fun and catch him. It was a blast out here at Aloka. It was, uh, didn't know what I was doing at first. I think I'm on to him now, so that's fun. He made mine for sure. See it. Well, that's gonna do it for today's video. Thank you guys for watching. I wish I would have uh, been a little more experienced with this film stuff and not filled up my GoPro with a uh, video that doesn't even matter. But you know, I got videos of the fish I caught, but I didn't get the fight, which sucks. But you live and learn making these videos. And it was a blast this afternoon coming out here. My first time ever in a new kayak, fishing this new lake I've never fished before. Struggled for the first couple hours and I got onto him and it was bam, bam, bam with that six pounder at the end. What a fish. That was, I'll have to say that's probably one of my biggest fish I ever caught, bass-wise. Yep, well, until the next video, thank you guys for watching, and I'd like to say thank you guys for the support in the last video. It means a lot to me going through and seeing the views and the likes. Thank you guys a lot, and until next time, see ya.